Here's my feeling whether Vegas is ready for us or not. Get ready. Be a Raiders fan is, is the commitment to excellence. It's that family bond. When you pick up those colors, be prepared, have thick skin, have conviction in your beliefs because you will be tested every day. To me, it's an honor. You know, um, there's no fan base like it. All I know is I feel it every Sunday. When I wake up, when I play the autumn wind, just that sound alone gets you fired up. I've been ready to gesture since 2018. I was on the look for a costume. You know, I wanted something that was going to match my personality. That just matched me perfect. It's like a class clown to me. I just love to have fun. How the violator came about, okay. I never sit, I always stand. You know, just that game day energy. There were a group of people who maybe weren't as into the game, as excited as I was. So they would always question, uh, why don't you ever sit? You know, so I'm going to go back to the swag in college. Everybody stood. We didn't need seats, we didn't use them. Everybody stood, that's that game day energy. I got tired of them questioning me standing, so I says, I'm gonna express it, and let them see what I'm feeling inside all the time. So that's how it came about. The spikes represent pain, it, we're at war. 57, that's my kudos to Jerry Robinson. Violator, it just means to annihilate anything on offense. I'm a defensive guy. Anything on offense, you mow it over. And all the, the gauntlets, that's like I say, that's just to protect me because I get excited. I may hit, rub up against somebody the wrong way, but that means, you know, you're too close, get back. And of course, every pirate's got to have his blade. Me, it was just love at first sight. I, I haven't seen a team that has such a rich tradition about them. Being the outsider for one, that was my attraction to them. They didn't look like any other team in the league. Two of my kids there, the wife in the back there, good guy. Of course, Coach Grew, the tailgate crew. This is a cutout from my Corona promotion. They were like our tailgate sponsors. Growing up, seeing the Raiders, you know, on the field, Smash Mouth football. That was kind of like our life, going to work, waking up every morning. Uh, you know, you got to get up, support your family, pound for pound, you know what I mean? Uh, hour by hour. Raider, Tide, Laundry Soap. When the Raiders won the AFC Championship, uh, I saw these at the store, never opened it. We are walking down the ice cream aisle, and, uh, and I said, oh, sh look. This is Raider ice cream. When the Raiders moved to Vegas, I was excited. I was happy. Al Davis' dream was to have the Raiders to have their own stadium as a franchise. Look, we won three Super Bowls, and we still didn't have a stadium. Now we're in 2020, the Las Vegas Raiders. They have their own stadium. They have their own home. They don't have to share it with a, a baseball team, any other football team. It is their home. Vegas is their official home now. No other stadium will look like that one. I can almost guarantee that. That fits us to a T. I don't know who designed it, but they hit it. Brass tack on the head. It doesn't matter where they go. I'm a Raider fan regardless. That's the beauty I've experienced, just meeting people from all over the world. Some of them I can't even communicate with, but we're here for these colors. If they went to China, we would still be rooting for the Raiders. They got just so much support out here in Vegas. Being a part of something that is more deeper than anybody or any other fan could ever understand. Raider fans get it. I get asked often, oh, is the black hole gonna be? I don't know what they're gonna call it there, but I know the spirit of the black hole people is not gonna change. So if we're there, you're gonna know we're there. Now everybody else can either get in with us as a nation or stay to yourself. <laughs>